This video will show you how to use a Fanville door phone with a Fanville C600 without a PBX. The first thing you will need to do is find the IP address of your Fanville door phone. You can do this by holding the hash key for 3 seconds and the door phone will announce its IP address. One, nine, two, dot. You will then need to find the IP address of the Fanville C600. To do this, click Settings and the IP address will appear. Now, go to the web interface of the Fanville door phone by browsing to its IP address in the web browser. You will need to configure the door phone's function key so that it will dial the Fanville C600 when pressed. To do this, go to the function key and paste the IP address of the Fanville C600 in the number 1 and number 2 fields. Click Apply. You will then need to find the RTSP video stream from the door phone. Go to EGS settings video and copy the mainstream URL. After you've done this, you will need to go to the web interface of the Fanville C600. By default, the Fanville C600 doesn't allow direct IP calls. To allow this, you need to go to VOIP SIP, SIP Global Settings and uncheck Enable Strict UA Match. Then click Apply. You will then need to create an action plan so that the Fanville C600 will show the RTSP video stream from your Fanville door phone when it receives a call. To do this, go to Phone, Action Plan. Enter the IP address of your Fanville door phone in digit map. Change the direction to both and paste the mainstream URL from your Fanville door phone in the URL field. Click add. Then repeat this step again but change type to connected. This will make the video remain on the screen when the call is connected. If you are still having trouble using a Fanville video door phone with a Fanville C600 without a PBX, please do not hesitate to call our office on 0333 014 4340 and one of our experts will be happy to help.